You know, I went on the Arkansas Lottery website uh, the other day, and I found a real interesting section on there. It's entitled, Play Responsibly. It has 21 questions on here, and according to Gamblers Anonymous, if you answer seven of the 21 questions in the affirmative, then you probably have a gambling problem. The state of Arkansas has gone out here and started an operation that they know is going to, going to cause problems for the people. They acknowledge it. And they said, you may be a problem gambler if, if you answer seven of these questions in the affirmative. And let me, let me just read you some of these questions. It says here, is gambling affecting your reputation? Well, I guess it depends on who your friends are. But, uh, you know, they, they would say, is it affecting your reputation? Do you feel remorse after gambling? Well, I'm sure you do. If you lose, I'm sure you feel bad about losing. Uh, here's another one. It says, do you ever gamble to get money to pay debts or solve financial difficulties? You know, the, the lady who won uh, the other day was interviewed on the news. They said, what are you going to do with this money? Pay my debts. And I think a lot of people are playing the lottery, hoping they'll win money they can pay their credit cards off. Um, does gambling cause a decrease in your ambition or efficiency? Well, yeah, if you're standing over there at the convenience store buying lottery tickets all day, I suppose it would affect your efficiency. Or after losing, do you feel you must return as soon as possible and win back your losses? Well, I think that's the tendency of most people to say, I lost $10, how can I get it back? And here's another one. After winning, do you have a strong urge to return and win more? Well, I think most people would. And so I think if you read this list, what you're going to find is probably a majority of the people would end up saying yes to seven questions on here. Maybe when it's all said and done, a majority of the people who end up playing the lottery do have a gambling problem. This, this brings us to a, to a real important question, and that is, if we know that the state-run lottery is going to create all these problems, why are we doing this in the first place? I think the, the people who are running the lottery know that it's going to do that because they have this section on here to play responsibly and they have this Gamblers Anonymous number and all this stuff on here. I, I think there's so much more to the lottery than meets the eye and I think a lot of people in Arkansas are going to realize that as time goes by.